Do you feel the vibe? You know, I was nervous at first, but Codsworth's really good with Sean. But then we're looking at a cold front coming down from Canada, making it crisp and dry for next week's Halloween festivities. Looking in on next week's forecast, we have a high of 52 on Monday. But also appear our troops stationed overseas are experiencing some unusual weather as well. On the island of Mamba Jiao, the nights are cold, unseasonably so for Southeast Asia. But for the 5th Infantry, that's as comfortable as an autumn jamboree. All the easier for our mechanized Hellcast to drive any screaming commie memes. Can you get that? It's probably that salesman. Good morning! vault calling. Something that is unquestionably Good morning. Isn't it? Just look at that sky out there. <clears throat> You can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. What's the... Why, nothing less than your entire future. If you haven't noticed, sir, this country has gone to heck in a handbasket. If you'll excuse my language, the big kaboom is... It's inevitable, I'm afraid. And coming sooner than you may think, if you catch my meaning. Now, I know you're a busy fellow, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being a, uh, mm -hmm, a precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. But there's room for my entire family, right? Of course, of course. Minus your robot, naturally. In fact, you're already cleared for entrance. It's just a matter of verifying some information. Don't want there to be any holdups in the unforeseen event of <laughs> total atomic annihilation. <laughs> Won't take but a moment. Sure, let's do it. Splendid, splendid. Now, uh, let's see. Wonderful. That's everything. Uh, just gonna walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, thanks again. Hey, it's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Good answer. I have my moments. been changed when he absolutely refuses to calm down. I think he needs some of that paternal affection you seem to be so good at. <laughs> you heard Codsworth. Go on. How are the two most important men in my life doing? Spin the mobile a bit. He loves that. Hey, how's 
my little guy. Much better now, huh? Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. Yeah, sounds like fun. Sir, Mom, you should come and see this. Codsworth, what's wrong? Followed by... Yes, followed by flashes, blinding flashes. Sounds of explosions. We're uh, trying to get confirmation. What? We seem to have lost contact with our affiliate stations. We do, oh, we no. do have... We do have coming in. That's, um, confirmed reports, I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. My God. Oh my God. We, we need to get to the vault. Now! I've got Sean. Let's go. Residents of Sanctuary Hills, if you are registered, evacuate to Vault 111 immediately. To get in. But we're on the list. God, we're gonna die! Infant, adult male, adult female. Okay, go ahead. Thank you. You two, follow me. Come on. What's gonna happen to all those people outside we're the gate? Everything we can. Now keep moving. Step on the platform in the center. Almost there. We're gonna be okay. I love you. Both of you. We love you too. Oh my god! Hold on! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! We did it. We made it. We're okay. Everyone please step off the elevator and proceed up the stairs in an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. We'll get everyone situated in your new home. Vault 111. A better future underground. So we just... Yes, up the stairs. Vault 10 is here for you. Minute. Oh, this no, no, no. Don't about that. Female and infant. Really Step over to the table. Take a seat. You'll need your seat Welcome. before uh, we can take you. Okay. Thanks. Seat right over there. What now? Just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where to All go. All right, you three. Follow me. See, this is our new home. Oh, you're gonna love it here. This is one of our this most way, advanced please. facilities. Not that the others aren't great, mind you. Just it's this gone. Way. Our home. Sir? Everything we had. My mother and father down in D.C. How, how long do you think we'll be down here? Oh, <laughs> we'll be going over all that in orientation. Just a few medical items we have to get through first. Just checking everyone off the list as they come in. Prepared for the future, right? Such a lovely family you have. I hope you'll see this as your new home. Just step in here and put your vault suit on. Pod will decontaminate and depressurize you before we head deeper in the vault. Just relax. Time for a whole new life. Resident secure. Occupant vitals normal. Procedure complete. In five, four, three. This is the 
one. Here. Open it. Has to be a release! Come on, come on, come on! Oh God! I'll find who did this. And I'll get Sean back. I promise. Giant roaches? What the hell? Where is everyone? Is this all that's left?
anyone alive? Did anyone get out? to the world. The world, sir? Well, besides our geranium still being the envy of Sanctuary Hills, I'm afraid things have been dreadfully dull around here. Things will be so much more exciting with you and Mrs. Dak. Where is your better half, by the by? They... They killed her. Sir, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, uh, I believe you need a distraction. 
Yes, a distraction to calm this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers, or perhaps charades. Sean does so love that game. <laughs> Is the lad uh, with you? Sean's been kidnapped. But I'm going to find him. I'm going to get my son back. It's worse than I thought. <laughs> You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> 200 years? What? Are you... A bit over 210, actually, sir. Or oh, give or take a little. For the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> That means you're, uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack? <laughs> you must be famished. Codsworth, you're acting... a little bit weird. What's wrong? I... I... Oh, sir, it's been just horrible. Two centuries with no one to talk to, no one to serve. I spent the first ten years trying to keep the floors waxed, but nothing gets out nuclear fallout from vinyl wood. <laughs> nothing! And don't get me started about the futility of dusting a collapsed house. <laughs> and the car, the car! How do you polish rust? What do you know, Codsworth? Uh, I'm afraid I don't know anything, sir. The bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry. I thought for certain you and your family were... dead. I did find this... hollow tape. I, I believe the missus was going to present it to you. As a, as a surprise. But then, well, every... Thank you, Codsworth. Now, shall we? There's nothing left here. Well. Tell me pretty lies. Look me in the face. Tell me that you love me.